Okay, by request from several of you over the last several months, I'm going to go ahead and do a food review. I'm heading to BK. I've picked out a couple of burgers. We'll see if they got them in stock and uh, take them home and uh, we'll check them out. So I've kind of held off on doing these mostly because of what's been going on the last year in my life if you all follow my channel and just been really tight on spending so but yeah things have stabilized for now so I figured all right I know a lot of you have been requesting uh, me going back to making some uh, fast food reviews and all so that's what I'm going to do and uh, see what you think. Pass by the pretty water fountain. Back in service I see. Alright, we're here at the BK. Squeeze on into the old drive through Wait. Finally. Yeah, like uh, one mushroom Swiss king and a steakhouse king. And that's it. Thirteen oh six. All right. Thirteen oh six. Oh my goodness. I like that hat, dude. <laughs> no top, just cut out in the center. I hear you. as the BK chooches. Oh, come on. Good. Good. Okay. okay. Alright, All right. thanks a lot. Right. You too, appreciate it. Ten minutes. Man, they are not fast here, but I guess it's fresh off the grill, so I'll take it. And we'll check it out when we get to the house. Alert. Meet the cops. How about another look at the Purdy Fountain? Butamus. Alright, home. Get out the old napkins, I'll be needing those. We'll check out these burgers here and get a good look at them. Let's see, this looks like the steak, and this is probably the mushroom. So let me open them up and we'll get a little gander at them. Oh, yeah, about the same size. They both smell good, too. So this one I'm assuming is the mushroom. E yep, it is. So, yeah, all caked on there with some bacon and mayonnaise. Man. Looks pretty good, and uh, yeah, two two slabs of meat. Looks good, and this one is the steak burger. I guess it's got the A1 steak sauce on it because I can smell it, the bacon and uh, mayonnaise, and uh, yeah, I guess the old beef patties that are supposedly a quarter pound. So yeah, I'll get this set up and uh, I'll. You can watch me stuff my face as I see how they taste. <laughs> okay. Yeah, first off, yeah, I wrote some notes or printed them out actually. The mushroom Swiss king sandwich features two slices of Swiss cheese, which uh, I guess they're melted in there. That's what it is, along with the mayonnaise. So, yeah, one between the slab of meat here. Yeah, and one on the top. Mm. Good stuff. And uh, it's between two quarter pound savory flame grilled beef patties topped with a thick cut smoked bacon, hearty mushrooms, and 
creamy mayonnaise all on a toasted sesame seed bun. The weight is based on pre-cooked patties. Yeah, that's a funny thing. So you're getting, you're paying for a quarter pound of savory flame grilled beef patties, but that's before they're cooked. So you're probably looking at maybe an eighth. I'm just guessing. I don't know. Somebody wants to actually get technical about that, you know, to find out what the exact weight is. <laughs> that's even close to a quarter pound after they're cooked. That'd be interesting to know. And then the Steakhouse King, well, I'll read that after I get, I'll go ahead and sample this one first. This is the uh, Mushroom Swiss. So, yeah. That yeah, bacon's pretty good. Mm-hmm. That was actually not bad. There's not a whole lot of bacon on it. I mean, from what I can see, even though it's describing it as uh, um, yeah, thick cut smoked bacon didn't look too thick to me. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad. Mm, let's see. No. Nope. Didn't give me a receipt. Damn it. I should have checked that before I left. But, you know, it's 1306, you know, with tax. So we're probably looking at about uh, six, probably around six dollars per burger. Well, not bad. Move that out of the way. I'll finish it later. We'll move on to the old Steakhouse King. Have some cherry coke. Uh. All right. Let's see how this one tastes. Yeah, that's actually really good. England steak sauce? Let me read this, I forgot about that. Sandwich features the same two quarter pound savory flame grilled beef patties. Topped with half strips of thick cut smoked bacon, A1 steak sauce, thick and hearty sauce, crispy onions, American cheese, and creamy mayonnaise. There man, there are onions in here? They're probably buried. I didn't see them. I don't know. I don't see the onions in here. Usually you taste that, but yeah, it's got the American cheese in here and the mayonnaise and all that. So yeah, um, I don't know. I don't see the onions though. So and of course it's on the signature sesame seed bun again, based on pre-cooked patty weight, quarter pound. So. Yeah, um, I don't know, unless these are the onions, these little crispy things, I guess maybe that's what they're talking about. Crispy onions, okay, yeah, so it's in little little chunks, not like onion rings or anything like that, so, okay. Noted for future reference. Hmm. Yeah, they want steak sauce. Makes a world of difference. That is really good. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. Overall, both burgers aren't bad. Of course, for the price, you know. Be prepared to pay, and that's just the burger, about six dollars. I didn't even get the combo, so I can imagine the combo is going to be pushing probably close to nine, ten dollars for sure. So, 
Yeah, I just wanted to sample the burgers. I already know what the fries taste like, and of course the drinks. I've got plenty of drinks here, so yeah. Um, I would recommend either of them, but the steak burger for sure. The Steakhouse King. Yeah, that's that A1 steak sauce adds uh, adds some good flavor to it. So. Yeah, um, if you guys have any other recommendations or ideas for food reviews, you know, leave them in the comments. I'm uh, curious to know what you guys would like to see. And uh, again, there's just so much out there, so many different fast food restaurants and items that they offer, and new items that sometimes I may not be aware of. So, yeah, leave a comment. Let me know what you what you want me to review next, and I'll see what I can do. So, hope you enjoyed it. Go try these out. I like them. I'm uh, I'm set. The Mushroom Swiss King and the Steakhouse King. So, from BK. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed this review. Until next time, adios.